Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And very excited to bring you live action from the Dritte Liga coming right up. It's 1860 and they face MSV Duisburg. Thanks Derek as always, this should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium, we've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, three goals in the last three games. He's in great form at the moment. And he's playing with confidence as well. Every chance he could add to that tally today. The lineup for 1860. Well, it's a 4 3 3 with two out and out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated and it could be difficult for them. And the match begins. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Well, full marks for trying, but very deftly cut out. Moll. Salger. Philipp Steinhardt. Stefan Lex. Lex. Capable of so much better from that position. Marvin Bacalords. Has eyes for goal. And it goes. That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Well, back underway and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Taking it away. Yankadi. Murders. Showing a real will to win the ball. Back here. Marlon Frey. Beautifully disguised ball. A terrific piece of goalkeeping. Yeah. 
Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Dangerous looking attack. He has time to play it over. Bacalords. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. And a fine tackle. Moll. Well, they continue their push for the equaliser, but definitely not forcing it. This looks interesting. Gives it a go! And that wasn't a million miles away, almost the equaliser. Well, it's not a bad effort, is it? But they've got to find a way back into this one. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. This could square the game, but the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Back here. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Not the best clearance. Oh, moving it nicely. Now well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Bear. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal to put them in front, but he's looked lively throughout too. Hopefully, we see more of him in the second half. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Moritz Stoppelkamp. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Marcel Baer, Stefan Lex, Moll, and they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. And he's got a score to level it again. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. Back underway. Level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Zalga. Moll. 
Kirin Moll. Stefan Lex. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. No way through. Kolja Push. And possibilities here. Crucial interception amid impending danger. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. Possession given away. Could cross it in here. Very quick thinking there. And a throw in forthcoming. Push. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider. 20 minutes remaining. Marcel Baer. Oh, potential danger. Baer. Will it happen for them? This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. And a substitution in the offing. <laughs> Playing it in. Well, the keeper won't be complaining about that corner kick delivery. His ball all the way. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, far from the cross he had in mind. Goal kick it is. So making the substitution now. Zalga. How can they find a late leveller? Struggling to keep the ball. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Oh, 
Well, he's given the ball away unnecessarily. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Ayani. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?